refunds. Okay, so let's look at my side quest list and let's see what things we can do right now. Shall we? I still have the scavenger hunt to do. I don't know if I can finish it right now, but maybe. I never did find that fungus. Oh, it's at the top of the falls. I never did do that. I didn't go do this thing with my brother. I didn't go find finish finding Queepy. So let's go do some of these things, shall we? There was a lot of stuff kind of left undone out there in the forest. You know what else I should do? Nah, I'm going to go do side quests first. Fuck that. Side quest first. What's up, little guy? So I feel like going around trying to find all the things is still going to bring me to some dead ends where I just didn't, I'm not able to do them yet, you know? Let's go to the questionable area, shall we? Back to the questionable area. And find Lily's fungus in her questionable area. Whoa. You don't usually see this in the physical world. What a strange place. Oh, now that I can slow down the wheel, I wonder what that does. Yep. Let's find out what slowing down the wheel does. What does that accomplish? Does it allow me to ride up the log? Like, I'm confused by that whole situation. I guess so. That's exactly what it does. It lets me get over here to the log. Okay. Okay. On Monday, it's going to be two years since you followed the Funky on Twitch. Yo, Garzonis, almost got that two-year follow age. Let's go, dude. Oh, motherfucker. We're going for a ride, y'all. Are you ready? Is this even going to work? I don't even know if this is going to work. I feel like we're going to fall off. Oh, no, it actually does work. Nice. So I was supposed to jump off over there. Learn the hard way, I suppose. I realized what I was supposed to do now. At least I think I do. Now that I know I'm supposed to, like, go over there. Do 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 do. Yeah. Woo! Okay, I'll admit, the waterfall is pretty questionable. Made it. It's a very questionable waterfall, for sure. You instead, I'll do it. <laughs> okay, Lizzie. You were playing Mario Golf back then? You just couldn't pass up such a good game? Mario Golf? I was playing Mario Golf? Did a psychic hurt you in your past or something, goat? Whoa, what the fuck? Goat's so slippery. Maybe we should talk to this girl real quick. Hello. Hey, Lizzie. Not now, Pooter. I'm trying to abduct a goat. Why? For dinner. I need to bring an animal to my mentor. Even though that sounds creepy. Okay. Have fun with your goat. It was a fortune cookie Friday. That's a special fungus. Right back but I don't think it's a very special goat lice, okay? When you say Mario Golf, was I just playing like the NES original ass golf on NES? Is that what I was playing? Oh, I can probably get up here just by writing the fucking thing. I just have to fix it. Friend Compton, you guys can talk about beards. Oh, I can bust it with side blast. I see. Well, what if I that's cool. You a tin can to eat? Another card. That's eight cards. Yep. Or rather, I need eight more to finish. Dude. 
So? Take it anyways. Don't be a bitch. Ooh, I need that skull, I guess. It looks shiny. Another scavenger hunt. Another scavenger hunt item. Hell yeah. Questionable gifts. Let's see what we got. NES Open Tournament Golf. Okay. Got it. Yes, I recall that game, Garzonis. I was thinking of just basic bitch-ass NES golf. But you're right. It was NES Open Tournament Golf. Either way, good times. That was an early fortune cookie game for sure. Ooh, there's a key over here. Ooh. One more supply chest key in this area. Cool. You gonna bounce out, Mono? All right, man. Thanks for hanging out. Appreciate it as always, sir. And you have, you know, you have a good night. And stay sexy, homie. forgave you so easily can we talk about you being psychic now Ugh, look Raz I know we played all kinds of weird brain games when we were kids but I'm not ready to break mom and dad's hearts like you did okay how long does the family plan to stay out here just until the circus makes enough dough to pay for the trip home why don't you stay here with me and do what Join the intern program. That sounds humiliating. It is, but it builds character. I think. I'll, uh, consider it. Maybe I'll check the place out for a while. If we can win over mom, that is. If. Bye, crazy. Later, traitor. We have to win mom hey, over? Crazy. I can't believe mom forgave you so easily. There had to be more of that conversation. Bye, that was Later, it? Later, traitor. That was it? Okay, well, I don't know if there's more to that. BZ's combos for later, but there you go for now. That's the bitch ass sister who was throwing rocks at me and shit. Punk ass. I think it's not running right now for some reason. How do I climb up here? Hello? Oh, maybe from the inside? Nope, not like that. Maybe like that. Give me that shit. That's another level up point. Let's go. Grab it before it hurts somebody. Somebody, anybody tell me why. A -a 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 -a. Okay, so the thing I did with the logs was clearly not the answer to whatever the hell it was that I needed to do. So I think I can just get up here like pretty easily just from that tram thing. I'm done asking. Oops. Pretty sure I need to climb up, get back over there. So hold on. On you stupid goat. Man, I really need to work on my TK. Yeah, you do. Okay. What do I got to do? Huh. I don't understand what I did wrong. Huh. Oh, there's a break in the waterfall. There you go. This is what I was missing. Here we go. This is the special fungus. 
just bring a little bit back. Hope this helps her treat her dad. That's a big ass fungus, though. That wasn't too bad. I just needed to know what to do, RPG fan. Obviously, I didn't want you to tell me. I wanted to figure it out, which I did, so cool. I miss anything down here before I go? Hmm, there's a path over here. Hold up. Where's this go? Ah. Worth checking. Yes. More money! Hell yeah. I think I have one more chest key to find in this area, right? I believe I had three or four. But I think I've already used a couple in this area, so we might only need the one more just to finish this off. Oh, where does this gonna mount? Uh, hello, hello. Where are we? Donde esta am I? I mean, I hear the... I, I see the clairvoyant. Oh, he probably has to look at that hole. Okay, I get it. Clairvoyance boy. All right, hold up. Let me get clairvoyance out. I said let me get clairvoyance out. Thank you. An easy one. Easy one. Yeah, I'm glad there's no figments out here in the real world, but I knew that because, you know... That's why they're figments. They're in people's minds. It makes sense. Anyway, I hear the music, which means my brother is over here somewhere. He's up there. Okay. I think I have to find him in six different places based on the side quest thing. Have I been over here? This doesn't feel familiar. I don't think I've been in here. Yeah, this is new. I don't know what path I've found myself on to get over here, but I have not been over here. Got a side card. Five more cards in this area, bitchin'. Another card, bitchin'. I'll take that card. I'll take the card. No problem, no problem. Anyway, here's my creepy little creepy brother. I'm starting to see why this questionable area went out of business. What are you listening to? Some local radio station. I have no idea where it's coming from, but I love it. Oh, can I listen to it with you? No. Also, one second. Okay, so I guess we're going swinging on over there because there doesn't seem to be anything else up here. Yep. Hey, I do already have the chest. Hey, welcome to the stream, Flower Heart. How are you doing? Welcome in, welcome in. Okay. Oh no, I didn't want to. Uh, did I care if I fell down? I guess I didn't really care. I didn't lead anywhere. It didn't seem like. Okay, so I haven't really been in this particular area. Fuck your boxes, money. You're a psychonauts lore nerd. Oh boy, here we go. Well, just I'll give you the warning now, just because I know you're new and I know you, you know, you just came in, so I'm not gonna. I don't want to hear anything about the story that I haven't already gotten to, obviously. You can clarify and elaborate on anything I've already been learning. That's fine. And also, I don't want any direction on, directions on where to go at all unless I literally ask the chat for them. I already f did this. This was one of those things. But welcome in regardless. How, hope you're having a good evening. Or day, whatever time of day it is for you. 
Um, okay, so I need to find Dion. I don't have no idea where that motherfucker's at. I'm also looking for my creepy little brother again since I found him twice. I hear the music again. Is he up there? Oh, he's way the fuck up there. Okay. Uh, how did we get up there again? Didn't we get up there already once? Oh, there's that's the skating girl. Okay, I was like, who the hell's that? I need to get up there again. How did I get up there again? Uh, I don't remember if I ever actually got up there. Nah, I, that's fair. If I have questions about lore, I'll come to you first, Flowerheart. For sure. I appreciate the offer. Always good to know more things if you don't know. You do like that they clue you into his location with the music? Yeah, it's a nice way to, like, not have to be like, Yo, here he is on the map, stupid. It's like, nah, just listen in. You got audio cues, oh, which is nice. And I have not been up here, obviously, because that card was there. Um, oh, I can climb the vines on the tree. That's what I need to do. I didn't really realize there were vines on the tree. Okay, I see it now. Got it. The vines never stand out to me as something I can interact with, I swear. Never. They never have. They barely ever do. You want to hug Raz's grandma? I mean, she's kind of funny. Don't talk about the curse. It's not allowed. Yeah, other games would have a waypoint and shit. Yeah, exactly. But no, not this game. This game doesn't do waypoints, at least not that I've seen. I just want to dance with you. I need my me time. You never let me do me, Raz. God. God, I fucking hated the new Space Jam movie so much. Has anybody here seen the new Space Jam movie? Space Jam New Legacy, or the fuck it's called? I fucking hated that line that I just said alone. I fucking hate that shit. My dad never lets me do me. Key up! No! I was hoping. I was hoping. I don't know how I'm supposed to get up there, but I was hoping. Part of me was hoping. Oh, I'm probably supposed to get to it from the other side over here. Okay. That would have been pretty epic if I made that, though. You know it would have been. Yeah, you don't get me time till you're 30 at least, Queepy, okay? And even then, that's not guaranteed, fucking T, okay? I need to get onto that. Onto that somehow. Yeah, the new Space Jam movie is the one with LeBron. It sucks. Don't watch it. I was just curious if anybody did watch it, that's all. I don't recommend it. It's not very good. But, you know, of course he has his son in the movie. It's not his real son. It's, you know, acting son. And he does the stupid shit. He's like, my dad never lets me do me. It's like, shut up, LeBron. And fake LeBron son. No one cares. How the hell do I get up there, man? That's going to bother me. Yo, solved it. If there was a problem, yo, I'll solve it. Check out the hook while the funky resolves it. Hell yeah. Let's fucking go. All right, that's all I wanted to know. So it's the Shaq Fu of films? I wouldn't say that. It's the not very good of films that much. I can guarantee you, though. You fucking squirrel. Go back to your fucking spot, you whore. Red, 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 red. It won't let me do the thing. Oh, yeah, it will. Never mind. Thought it wouldn't let me. You do remember the original one with MJ? Yeah, the original Space Jam is memorable. 
is actually memorable. I actually like that movie when I was a kid, especially. Watching it now, it's nostalgic for me, and I would very much rather watch that. The new one takes away anything enjoyable about it. Anything enjoyable about the original, they decided not even to focus on any of that in the new one. And that's the problem I had with the new one. Ah, maybe here's the brother. No, this is this bitch again. Oh, no, this is... Okay. This is my dad, though. What's up, dad? dad? It's my dad. Hi, son. Think I'm getting any better at this? It's not that hot take, that hot of a take to not like Space Jam original. If you didn't grow up with it, and you, or if you did grow up with it and you didn't like basketball or Looney Tunes or whatever, or if you just didn't like it, that's fine. I will by no means try to defend Space Jam as a good movie. I just liked it when I was a kid, that's all. Press harder on your temples. Really? I'm already getting a bit of a bruise there. Just keep practicing. That's it? Clear your mind. If it were any emptier, I'd pass out. Focus on the hottest thing you can think of. Okay, then. I'm thinking of your mother. Dad. Oh, my God. Beings, we fuck like rabbits, Rasputin. You're really taking to this psychic stuff. Like, really hard. Well, I guess I'm making up for lost time. Plus, it could be a fun father and son activity for us to do together, don't you think? Uh-huh. Totally. Dad, can I ask you about where we come from? You mean Glovia? That's a sad story, son, but there were some glory days back in the old country. The Aquatos were part of a very prestigious national circus there. We even performed for the Tsar and his family from time to time. But then that monster Maligula ruined everything. Actually, Maligula's not ancient history. Some of her followers are trying to bring her back to life. What? The Psychonauts think one of her delusionists have infiltrated the base as a mole. Then be careful what you tell them, son. The more connected to Maligula than you should say. Oh. What's that? What do you mean we're connected to Maligula? She comes from the Galocchio family. The family that cursed all of our family to die in water? Son, Mother fucker. She is the Galocchio who cursed our family to this die This motherfucker water. right and here. My father drowned in the Valermo Dam disaster. But my mother, your Nona, survived. Oh, she we're going to go ask Galocchio her about that? Came here Ooh, to get away Grandma. What do you think of the Devil's Fire Hose? No, oh, it's going to be a showstopper, I can tell. Your mother never disappoints, you know. I just wish she'd let me add a little, you know, razzle-dazzle. Oh, yes, like that. Thanks for helping out back at summer camp. Well, I could tell somehow you were in trouble. Probably because of our psychic connection. Totally. So, how is... Lily, I couldn't help but notice when I was inside your mind Dad. that you had some uncertainty about the status of your relationship. What's that? Just tell her how you feel, son. Tell us all how you feel, Raz. <sighs> Fuck this bitch. I don't think Mom's on board with this psychic stuff. Oh, she'll get used to it. Like she did with my model train hobby. <sighs> Still so sad about how that elephant sat on my whole collection. Dad, our circus doesn't have any elephants. Hmm. True. Not sure where that animal came from. I'll have to ask your mother. She's the one who saw it happen. Yeah, your mom sucks. You know who else in the family is psychic, right? Does it rhyme with Daisy? Yes, and also with Lazy. Huh. <laughs> Watch out for rocks. Well... If that's true, then it's for her to tell us about some, not you. <sighs> yeah, I guess you're right. <laughs> Damn it. I had that coming. I'll let you get back to practicing. Yes, yes. Pinecone upside the head, son. Okay. Hey, I found some of those scavenger mission critical psychonaut assets. And <laughs> did you see that? Hey, Norma. What are you doing out here with my dad? Oh, I'm sorry, Raz. Is this making you jealous? 
Did your dad not spend much time with you when you were growing up? No. I mean, yes. I mean, the average amount. <laughs> what a bitch. What a fucking bitch. All right, well, I don't know all about that, but we're looking for my little brother again, Queepy Boy. We've only found him like three times. I wonder if we should go back into this forest. I feel like we, there's still more to resolve here with this guy. Like, we sent him back into the forest. Or maybe he resolved it on his own. Maybe we should take a visit. Let's give him a visit. Oh, friendo. Is everything okay with you and your, your long-lost beloved who became a bee monster? Maybe. Oh, I never tried to go past this. Which sure are disorienting. Oh, what's back here? Wait a second. Oh, I sent you back to the beginning. Okay. That's actually fine. I'm fine with that, actually. Queepy, queepy. So, yeah. Oh, I hear him now. Is he up on one of the ledges? Welcome to my mind. Welcome to my mind. Doo -boo -doo -boo -doo. I think you're right. I think I remember them saying that the Golokios were a rival circus family. I think it's not running right now for some reason. We need more cogs. I think you're right. I do remember them mentioning Golokio as a rival circus family, though. Makes a lot of sense why she would curse the family then. Looks like there's just one more part to find. One more part, eh? Ah, kids today. Oh, kids, you're just so hilarious. Oh, there it is right there. Ha. Booyah! And now we have a ride. Where is the brother? He's up in the tree. Okay, he's at the top. Okay, I, I remember that now. Did I miss anything up here? I don't think I did. This is a slow ride. Now, I mean, in their defense, they're not called fast -iculars. They're called funiculars, not, fa not fast. You right. Yeah, I don't know how the woman from the circus became like that, but I'm sure we'll find out eventually. Ah, uh, I didn't want to fall. Ah, uh, shiz nuggets. Oops. Alright, how did we get up higher? Was it this way? Yup. And then Sprungy Doing over there. There we go. Found him. Mom's really worried about you. Oh please. I'm the only one she doesn't need to worry about. Imagine how much pain her family would feel looking at what she became. Oh I'm sure. The pain of your child becoming that which is you you most hate or whatever. Welcome to my mind. Welcome to my mind. How did I miss the card right there? That card seems very obvious. <laughs> did you see that? How could I not? It caught fire. A little, bit. A little. Mr. Aquato. You almost started a forest fire just then. Well. This is not a hard one to get. I just completely overlooked it. Two more cards to find. All right. All 
All right, we're looking for the brother, the little brother, and I guess the bigger brother, Dion or whatever. I don't know where the hell he's at yet, but we'll find him. Maybe he's over here. Well, that answers that question. There he is. I haven't really looked over here in a while. Don't worry about helping out, Squirt. We're used to getting by without you. Oh, shut up! What do you need? Mm-hmm. Mom told me you needed help. With what? Reading crystal balls? Beat it, Nostra dumbass. Damn. Looks like you need someone to release the ropes. I'll just pop up there and take care of it. Oh, really, Mr. Mental? You think you even remember how to be an acrobat? You'll see. You think I need to be an acrobat to get up there, bitch? You sure look like you could use some help. You look like you could use a tailor. Fuck you, brother. You sure you're using the right knots on those support ropes? I don't know. Why don't you come a little closer so I can practice my knots on you? Very brotherly. Look, Dion. I know you're mad about me running away. <laughs> don't flatter yourself. If you hadn't stolen Frazy's horse, we wouldn't have even noticed you were gone. Bitch, please. Hey, I sent Sugar Cube back home as soon as I got to the train tracks. Poor little thing was exhausted. Next time you run away, instead of taking the world's smallest pony, call a cab. You'll get farther. Maybe we won't be able to find you. Man, what a what a spiteful dickhead brother. Don't you think it's time to get over your anti psychic He just stuff? jealous that he ain't psychic. I will when it stops hurting our family. Dad's a psychic. It's a phase. <laughs> it's a phase. Frazy's a psychic. Oh, that's a great example. Yeah, we should all be more like Frazy. Ow! <laughs> you wish you could be more like me. <laughs> Got he. How long are you planning on being mad like this? Forever. Do you even realize what you've done to the Aquato name? Psychics? Fortune tellers? You let out our family's worst secret. This family has too many secrets. We'll be better off when they're all out. We'll be better off when you're out. Damn. Dion. What a dickhead. Bye, Dion. Don't worry, I'm still gonna help your dumbass. Don't you worry. Alright, so. Hell yeah. Too easy. Okay, so that creepy mind stuff did save a little time. But I still don't have to like it. Deal. And you're welcome. No, I know what you meant, RPG fan. He deserved that fucking pine cone to the head for sure. Seeing the old Aquato Dome again reminds me of a trick Dion taught me once. Oh? New trick? The dive. If you need to bail out of midair situation, if you want to squeeze a little more distance out of your jump. Are you fucking serious? Wow, that's actually pretty sweet. It only works on a jump, though. It doesn't work when you're floating. Hey, Dion. Mm hmm. Bye, Dion. <laughs> that actually works really well with him. Hey, Dion. Bye, Dion. You dick. Ah, the Aquato Dome. It's not big, but then again, neither were our audiences. There's something I'm just in here. Happy that it's not made of meat. Yeah, really, though. Fucking the meat circus, man. Everybody loved that fucking place. As we've already brought up today. Whee! Sproing. Gotta be something in here. Even if it's just a card, there's something up here. Cool, I'm, I'm really glad I floated right by it. That was smart. Oh, it's one of these. Even better. Hell yeah. Alright, well that was worth it. Bitchin'. Cool. Glad we checked out this place. So in terms of quests, let's check the quest situation out real quick. 
Give Lily the Funky Fungus. I have that. I'm still missing 10 scavenger hunt items. That's crazy to me. I think I find Queepy two more times. So besides going back to Lily, we got to find Queepy a couple more times. That's my my biggest goal now. Find Queepy. Where he at? Where are you at, Brosif? What is that on top? Oh, that's another one of those scavenger hunt items up there, isn't it? Oh, maybe I can ride the wheel up there, maybe. Oh, yeah. Definitely the answer. All right, so that's one of the items at least. Ooh, the last key's over there, too. I didn't see that earlier. I don't think I've really, like, climbed up on these... On these trees over what? here. Get off the fucking thing, man! Jesus. I don't remember ever climbing up over here. Okay, this is just back over in the inside the family circus area. Discipline is all they need. Discipline, you wreck it. Wreck a discipline. Yep. Oh. Uh. Oh. I've never been up on that platform either. Jeez. Which room was this again? Oh, I... Alright. Just kind of getting my bearings again, like what what crevices left it led to where again. Yep. Hmm. How, pray tell, do I get up higher in this area? Get on top of this house maybe somehow? Climb this pole? No. Hmm. There's gotta be a way up there. I'm just not seeing. Ho hum. I gotta find the fucking creepy brother real quick. Unless he's up there, but. Let me go back over here for a sec. I don't really look, I didn't really look around over here for him. I hear him. He must be on the outside over here. I hear it. Oh, he's actually on top of the fucking restaurant. There's also a thing up there, which I didn't notice. Well, how do I get up the top of here, damn it? The lumberjack? Yeah. And then that platform? Yeah. Welcome to the questionable area, where the only answer is more questions. Oh, maybe questions? this is helpful. Okay, that's probably helpful, but I have to get up there. How do I get up there? Uh, 
Do I have a favorite video game story? Yours is Planescape, Tor Planescape Torment. I mean, I have a favorite video game, which is very story heavy. That's why it's my favorite video game story or video game. It's because of the story. My favorite video game is Sukaden 2. And thus, it's my favorite story. Huh. I am unclear. Can I climb this tent? In any helpful way, can I climb this tent? Well, let's see there's like slight looking platforms, but I don't think I can like use those. Man, I'm so not sure how to get up here. It's kind of ridiculous. Can I bounce on this fucking car? No. Hmm, how the fuck do I get up to this roof? Sukun 2 is one of those games you've always wanted to play. It lasted to be very expensive for you to get on PS1. Well, I guess emulation is probably the only way. Although I will say, it is still on the PSN on PS3. It hasn't gone away yet, I don't think. But if you don't have a PS3, obviously, then it's not really an option, unfortunately. Well, shit, man. I don't know how to get up there. I'm missing something or, like, not seeing something to get up there. Maybe I'll climb back up here and take a look around. Still got it. Okay. Maybe that platform I can take the rope across over to there? Like that's what it looks like, right? Funny thing is that even though Planescape Torment is, has your favorite story, it's not among your favorite games. You just love the setting, plot, and characters. But the gameplay drags the experience down. Well, the reason why Sukuna 2 is my favorite is because it has all the things like that I enjoy. It has all of them, the story included. Yeah, they make it seem like you can climb the ropes to get up there, doesn't it seem that way? Like, how else are you supposed to get up to the platforms up there? I don't really understand. Ow. Because the only other thing like available to me to do over here is to shoot this dude in the back again and wonder if it does anything different. Like the axe is lower. I think, okay, maybe that will help you get up there, but no. Yeah, I'm about to give up on this for now because I really don't know how to get up there. And I don't want to sit here and waste time doing this for too long. I'm already annoyed. All right, fuck this. We're going to go back to Lily real quick and turn in this mushroom. This fungus. She's like right outside the front area. She's right over Mia. Yep. 
Need to ride up, hold up. She over there? She over here. Forget exactly where she's at. That's her up there, right? I think so. There she is. Hey, Lily. I got that plant you needed. Thanks, happy, Rats. happy Lily Day. I know you only did it out of friendship, but let me give you this anyway. Makes me feel less guilty. Oh. Okay. Hi, Lily. Hey. I'll check in with you later, all right? Don't worry about your dad. He'll be okay. I hope so. Okay. So that quest though is done. Well, in terms of quests, all I have left is this damn scavenger hunt one and finding Queepy two more times, which I know where he is. I just don't know how to get up there, and I don't know if I can get up there. So I might just say fuck it and move on with the story. Like, oh fucking well. I just don't know what part of the game is going to be inaccessible after doing the last crawler. Is it actually stuff that's in in the lab area? I'm guessing yes, or like inside the base rather. I'm thinking they want you to like finish clearing out the inside part of the base, but I can't even do that technically because I can't get in the mail slot in like the mail room. There's some weird Trying to think if there's anything else I missed because I couldn't get to it or whatever. I'm gonna take a quick like lap around the whole facility just to see what I might have missed besides the mailroom like door that I can't slip in, you know? Obviously there's the two things up here in this area. So I'd very much like to figure out how to get up to if I can. If I, if I feel like there's a way to get up like above. So the think tank area, did I miss anything in here? Any cards or anything? Yep. Didn't seem like it. Planescape Torment has you playing as an immortal character who suffers complete amnesia every time he dies. It's the most interesting version of amnesia character I've ever seen. So I discovered more and more about his past lives along the way. Interesting. He's immortal though. But he's immortal in the sense that he keeps coming back. Interesting. Psy cards piling up. Turn them into side challenge markers. Interesting concept. Automatic. Scanning access granted. Uh, was there anything in this room I didn't grab? This room looks pretty cleared out. What about this way? Where the this is where. This is where the the uncle or whatever her dad. This is where Lily's dad is. Just checking to see if I missed anything in here. That's all. I don't think I did because I was able to open the door in the back. Let's make sure there wasn't anything else in here though. I don't think so. I don't think there was anything else in here. Yeah. Okay. Also, you have to wonder if Christopher Nolan played the game because it had an amnesia character tattooing messages on his skin to remind himself of things. And that was a year before Memento came out. Oh, interesting. Maybe. Although, I imagine movies have longer cycles of production than one year. One year is definitely not enough, so... Most likely, Memento was already in production. It just makes sense to like write stuff down if you have if you're an amnesiac. That part just makes sense. Chalala, chalala. Where have I been? Where have I not been? Can I go in the storage? No. Okay. Let's see. Oh, it's her room. Have we ever talked to this lady since 
she's been in her room. I don't think I ever talked to her. Is this a bad time, Mia? I wow. always have time for my kid ingenio. My kid ingenio. I got an achievement for talking to her. Wow. Are you worried about Maligula? Well, she died in the bottle of Grulovia, but sometimes the idea of someone is more dangerous than the person themselves. Her followers are what scare me. When someone devotes their life to a memory, they're capable of anything. Are you meditating? In a way. I'm reaching out to detect ripples in the psychic network around the world. What are you doing that for? I'm trying to find the illusionist activity around the world and report it to Agent Foresight down in the nerve center. Ripples? A name like Maligula carries heavy emotional baggage for many people. It's like a large stone dropped in a pond. Ripples spread out, bounce off each other. If you know how to read the patterns, they can lead you to the source. Can I ask you about the Psychic Six? Of course, Rasputin. Are any of them still around? Oh, yes. Besides Ford, you know, there's also Mentalis out in his workshop, still tinkering with his gadgets. Sasha is his number one customer. Dogen Bull's grandfather, Compton, is here as well, but he... he keeps to himself. The other survivors have gone their own ways, unfortunately. Okay. What happened to... Helmet Full Bear? Oh, that poor soul was lost in the Battle of Grulovia. I wish I could have met him. He seemed to have such a love of life. And color. Color indeed. Did you ever meet Cassiopeia? No, but I read her book, Mindswarm. Very inspiring. I'm actually using some of her multitasking techniques right now, talking to you while I work. Did you ever work with Lily's great uncle, Bob Zanotto? Oh, yes, poor Bob. He lost so much in the battle. It really took a toll on him. I know it was very difficult for Truman to let him go, but it was getting dangerous. Oh, what that poor family has endured. Well, enough about those guys. Yes, let's talk about us. Us? Are you worried about Truman? To be honest, I've never seen him like this before. But he's very tough, and he has his fearless daughter in there now, taking care of him. Have you talked to Sasha lately? Sasha and I are always talking. Oh, he says hello. <laughs> what do you think about those casino papers, Mia? Well, they were very disturbing, I'll say that. Dripping with resentment. And a fishy smell. That's the caviar. Ha ha ha. Great job on the casino mission, Dustpan. Not so bad yourself, Egg Beater. Ah, oh, well, you know. Now I know you would never tinker with my mind like that, darling, because I would levitate you to the moon. I would fuck <laughs> your shit Understood. off. Understood. Is it pronounced Mia or Mila? Well, it's short for Camila, you know? But when I first started here, Sasha mispronounced it and I thought it was so cute. I didn't have the heart to correct him, and now I kind of like it, darling. Find out anything new, Agent Bodello? No, darling, and I hate it. How about you? I have some leads, but nothing to report yet. Oh, that sounds exciting, darling. Well, I'll stop bothering you now. Never a bother, darling. Ciao. Ciao. Thank you for the talk. That was fun. Oh, my God. Anyway... Basically, that game is a, the that uh, Planescape game. It's basically a subversion of the Western RPG genre, similar to how the Mother series and other tales subvert the RPG tropes. Instead of it being an epic adventure about saving the world, it's an introspective journey of one man finding out who he is and trying to regain his mortality so he can finally rest in peace. You spend 90% of the game reading read walls of text from NPCs, and the dungeon crawling sections that make up the rest are, of it are lackluster. Even in the standards of the time, that was what hinders the overall package. Yeah. That doesn't sound like the most fun game, gameplay-wise. If it's a dungeon crawly Let wall of text type this. game, usually not the most fun kind of games. I'm not doing anything in here right now. I'm not gonna go back in any mines. Oh, I just hate to see you like this. Yeah, I think I'm ready to move on. Let's just go do the hair, the the barber thing, and see what happens. I don't really know what else to do here other than try to get this dang 
card out here. That's all I really want to try to do. But I don't really know how to get up high enough, man. Unless I just have to get to this platform. No, that's definitely not high enough. Where could I jump from to get up there, man? Kind of bothers me. Because it seems like it should be easy. But maybe I'm just missing an ability that I don't have yet that makes me jump higher, float longer, do something, you know? I don't know. I'm going to spend some money real quick and then we're going to move on. Welcome to the automatic. I'm actually going to buy... Well, first of all, I'm going to buy one of these because I have enough for a... Let's combine that another thing. So you can rank up! Rank up! Anything worth buying from the item shop? I guess I could buy this, get that last Psypop capacity, even though I haven't really been carrying around Psypops. It might be worth having one of these. I hope you never need it. Ooh, I should get some of those too. My mental energy has been lagging a little. And then I'm gonna buy. Anyway, you're a big fan of the Baldur's Gate games. So that should tell you something. I just like Baldur's Gate games, the second one most especially. Had a better balance of gameplay and story. That's cool. I'm going to do this one. More damage. I don't have a high enough rank to even equip this, so never mind. Not going to buy that. I'll do this one instead then. I don't think I need any more gadgets right now. Good, because I would never trust one to someone so young. Course. I can only equip three. I guess goodbye red love ball. I don't need it anymore. All right. Well, again, I don't know what I'm going to miss out on if I continue on with this, but at this point, it's like, whatever. If I want 100% this game and I can't do it after this, oh, well, I'll do it on another playthrough. This isn't that long of a game. Let's do it. Excuse me, Ford. Sorry, with a client right now. Obviously. Obviously. Think you'll be done with that haircut soon? Please, you can't rush an artist. I see a big missing chunk on this side. What's that? Not to fear, only temporary. All part of the process. <laughs> <laughs> Would you mind if I jumped into your mind for a second? Just to even out some split ends. If it'll keep you quiet, then go right ahead. Go right ahead. All right, y'all. Here we go. The last of the crawler mind jumps. Let's do it. Okay, well, again, I don't expect this place to take very long. Looks like there's 43 fig figgy figs here. Grulovi invaded. Oh, no. Czar Theodore's desperate plea for help. Freaking hair everywhere, man. It's creepy. Some Rumpelstiltskin shit. Someone's looking a little shaggy. I don't have to worry. A fresh cut and you'll feel like a whole new person. Just make sure you cut away the right parts, or your old friends will recognize you. Oh, okay. I'm here to recover a piece of Ford's mind. But something tells me it's up in that lighthouse. Something tells me. So do we not want to get caught in the spotlight? I'm confused. Does that matter? Anyway, um, it's interesting that it lets you tackle these Ford levels in any order. You did them in the exact opposite order of me. Interesting indeed. Bacon! This is probably the one they expect you to do first, to be honest, because, um, well, it's the easiest one to get into. You don't have to do any quests. You could have just walked right into the barbershop right away. I don't know, I just... I was never interested... 
been doing any of the forward crawler mind jumps until I had all the pieces. Once I learned that I was going to jump into... Or once I learned it was like a three-part thing, I was like, I'm going to do all three parts, and then I'll do the, like, turn them in, essentially. That's what I told myself anyways, and well, I followed through with that. You think you actually did this one even before Compton's cook-off and size King's sensorium? Yeah, probably. I mean, those were both part of... You know, the other ones. What the fuck? I don't like these. Gross! Gross. Every head has its undesirables. Lice! Yeah, ew! Can I burn them? Maybe I can burn them. Uh, okay, maybe I, I need a bed? Not safe. Hate these things. I wish I could just blow them away. Blow them away, you say? Oh, I can probably make this big ass fan move. It is a windmill, after all. Well, whatever. There's other stuff down here I didn't grab. Let's go back down. The sharpest blade is the one you'll never fail, Mal Malik Razors. The sharpest blade you ever need. Flashback to the invisible ra uh, invisible rats in Arbiter's Grounds. Oops. Oops. Hmm. And the other side things I missed besides that one up there. Oh, that's what I was trying to jump to, but I wouldn't let me. Huh. Why are you falling? What the hell? I'm missing something here, damn it. Oh, what the fuck? Stop it. Please remind me of the rats that would swarm you in Twilight Princess. Yes, that's exactly what they remind me of. Fuck those things. None of these will actually help me get rid of these. If they don't, if I can't burn them, then I can't blow them away. Here we go. I was like, "There's got to be a button." See ya. You get rid of those things, but they always seem to come back. Hi, tight. The SARS mysterious new weapon. Friendly floods. Yay. And then what? Do we turn it back off? Or I guess we could slow it down. Yep. Alright, I think I got all the ones that were in midair over there, so that's good. Oh my god, fuck off, Lice. Nobody likes you. This is their home. You're just a visitor. And they're just gross. 
I can't even climb out of here. Oh, shit. Well, I didn't mean to do that, but that works. Haha! -ha, totally did that on purpose. Accidents happen. Was no accident that was brilliant problem solving. That was accidental problem solving in my book, but you know what? I would have figured it out eventually. Don't you mean nobody lasts you? Ha ha ha. I guess that is what I meant. Cool job, bro. Why did it? Why? Why? Why did it just go keep going? Why? I didn't want to keep going. It just it just happened. Cool. Anyway, whatever. Yeah, I had a feeling that was gonna shoot that grating off. Makes sense. All right, over here we go. No. 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 Too. Here's the steamer trunk tag. Probably only the one bag tag here, I would assume. <laughs> I love, I love it. I fucking love it. Love it. It's what I wanted, totally. Tide turning Relovia. New war minister. Rides of waves to victory. Cool. Half a brain, or half a mind. Only one up in here, no surprise there. Is this one called Ford's Follicles? I didn't notice that till just now. Psychonauts summoned. It's Psy time. Paranormal person of the year, Maligula. Damn destruction drowns dozens into stable dictatorship. What a title, what a headline. Tsar flees coup d'etat. Can no one stop mad Maligula? Uh, here comes the Psychic Six. And, mm, yeah. Now they're sad. And they have to do it! Yep. Ford's Follicles, what a name. I wanted the health in that fucking can, and that thing went fucking flying. Oh well. <sighs> Only... 12 more, uh, what's it called? Fig filibusters, figments. It was Strike City and Crawler's Correspondence, okay. Suppose those make perfect names for a bowling one and a letter one. Don't come at me with a slap, homie. Show you slap. Bitch. Tell me no. To bust that water up on him. Bust the water. Yup. Ah. Sorry, insects, but you're in my way. Sorry, not sorry. What have you done? What have you done? Uh, cleaned up the streets. Those were peaceful protesters, Lucy. 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 They were lice, and I'm mad at them. Yeah, this one's probably not even going to give me that much details about, like, Crawler and for, uh, Crawler and Lucy's relationship. It's just going to be like, how did they know each other? Even though we already learned about them being together and the love letter and all that. That's why this one was probably intended to be first. I think I hear some 
There's the trunk. The crunk in the trunk. Hey! Got he. All right, other than finishing off the figments, I'm assuming that's basically it for this fucking world. Which there's still three more to go, which means they're probably on the way to the end here, I would hope. Lucy, is that really maybe not. You? I must have missed him somewhere. Boy, it's me, Raz. Are you really the same person I used to know? Ford, I just saw you. Remember the bacon? Now you're just I somebody you that I used to know. I feel a bad storm gathering. Drawn close. Very close. Uh, hey guys, that's a little bit too close, okay? Okay. Oh, maybe the figments still are up here. I won't say I missed them yet. Maybe they're on the way. Like there's one right there. Ow! Oh fuck, if you get touched by one of those, you're dead. You're dead meat, son. I honestly wasn't expecting that to be a one-hitter quitter. Woo. I didn't realize that was going to move. All right, one more. One more. It's probably up the way. On the way. On the way. There it is. Finish Ford's follicle. Hell yeah, I did. All right. Bitchin'. Wait a minute. You're not Lucy. It is such a relief to hear you say that. You're something from deep inside her. Something dangerous we accidentally unlocked. What? I am not that, but you know what? The last fragment is mine, bitch! Hey, you lousy little mite, how'd you get in here? Don't push me. I'll goggle a whole bottle of hydrocide if I need to. Lucretia went to Grulovia. She went back to protect her family, to help her country. Oh, but it changed her. War changes everybody. Inside all of us, we all have dark roots. Well, sometimes we need that darkness to survive. Careful. Sometimes it's hard to get it back in the bottle. Back in the bottle? All right, I definitely should have done that one first. If you want to get it in the right order, that's definitely the one you should do first. But I do like that you are capable of doing that order. That's pretty cool. Nice little non con non uh non-linear agent crawler how do you feel i've done a terrible thing and so have you but we just wanted to undo what maligula did to you maligula didn't do this to me that's the first thing i've learned in here the rest you're gonna have to see for yourself ruh -roh. oh I got two achievements for that. Ford, what is it? See for yourself. Uh oh. Oh shit, it's gonna be a whole other world right now? I wasn't expecting that. Oh, maybe it's a short one. There's only 20 figments. I'm kind of glad. I was about to be upset. I was like, man, I don't want to do a whole other world right now. I'm kind of trying to close down the stream, but I guess if it's a short one, maybe there's a. Just a quick story stuff and some boss fight situations. I don't know. But there's only 20 figments, which means it's going to be short. So that's good at least. When I, saw, when I see a figment, I'm like, ah, damn it, another world. Oh, fuck. Run for your life! Crash Bandicoot. Nope, I want that. Oh shit, jump in the hole, jump in the hole, jump in the hole, jump in the hole, ah! Agent Crawler, I'm getting less sure I want to see this. Oh no, I don't think you'll want to see this at all. Damn, bury me. I'm alive. And now I'm floating. 
And now I'm falling. What? Okay, I guess there's reasons to land on these platforms. Oh, it's the bowling game again. Hello. Hey, Ford, what's the deal with the Deep Six treatment? I did what I had to do. I loved her, after all. Wait, what? Someday when you fall in love, you'll understand. Someday you'll understand. But I love Lily already, but I won't say it. Okay. I guess we go from one to the other. Yep. Very missable figments though, because you're falling. What's going on here? What did you want me to see? I couldn't let her go free. She was a danger to the world. Even though it was the world that made her dangerous. Lucretia? Where is she? Safe. She's safe. Well, she was. But we all were. <laughs> Not anymore. Was she, like, trapped in his mind? Is that where she was this whole time? Like, she was in Crawler's mind? Is that why he's like, you fucked up, kid. Now we're all screwed. That would be interesting. Which means whoever sent me to put Crawler back together is guilty. But we'll see. We'll see. There's a bag tag on the back of that fucking fish. Mother effer. I want that. I will have that. You will not withhold it from me. It will be mine. Ah, oh, shit. No. Ah, oh, shit, son. I missed one of the things. No. I fucked up. Well, hopefully I got all the things in that room. Otherwise, I fucked up. No, 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 not again. Damn it. What? Oh, hello. It didn't occur to me that I could move. It just sat still for too long. I was like, what? Ha! Who's that? Now that's your grandparents, Laszlo and Marona. They drowned in the Valermo Dam disaster, remember? What? No. Grandpa Laszlo died there, but Grandma made it out and came to live with my father. No, Raz. She didn't. Uh-oh. I just saw her today. No, you didn't. Uh-oh. Grandma? <laughs> Grandma's got some splaining to do. Fucking grandma, dude. Oh, I got all the figgies. I think I've collected every figment in this mine. Sweet. I put her in the astral plane. One of Otto's inventions. Created to make permanent alterations to the psyche. Fucking grandma, dude. I also got the bag tag here, so hell yeah. I got an achievement for senior interns. That's cool. Oh, because I'm level 50. I'm level 50? God damn. I'm actually surprised I'm so high level already. I need to spend some of these points. I have 10 points to spend. Um, level duration. What do I want to use? <sighs> Let's just do the, the pyro damage increase, because that's helpful, even though I don't use pyro that much for damage. And I guess 
telekinesis grabs are quicker, I guess. That's fine. I can't afford it anymore, so we'll just save the rest for now. Other than the clairvoyance upgrade, but I don't care about that. All right, well, figgies are done, bag tags done. Let's just but see what the hell, the man. Will never forgive her, so I had to hide her somewhere safe. Oh no! I hid her among her family, Rasputin. Among your family. No, no, no! Mother fucker. Feelings on your father, so he would accept her. Except Maligula? Yes. As your grandmother. No! Motherfucker. Not Grandma. Oh, Let me shit. Go. Listen, Raz. I know you're mad. My great aunt killed my grandma. And so you made us babysitter for 20 years? Now look it. You spring this news on your family now, their memories will unravel, and there's no telling how they'll react. So? They might try to kill her. And? If Lucretia is attacked, if she feels the need to defend herself, that dark spirit could reawaken inside her. Maligula really could rise again. You're right to be mad, Rasputin. I was young. I made a terrible mistake. But we need to deal with that after we get control of this incredibly dangerous situation. She's not there. Probably wandered off into the woods again. She keeps doing that. I know where she's going. Do you? The Psychonaut started out here, in the heart of the forgetful forest. There's a compound deep in these woods, protected from intrusion by psychic devices, traps, and illusions. I think Lucy's trying to get in, trying to go home. Remember, mad later, mission first. Now stick close. I'll show you how to get through. Oh boy, I guess we're going to do this now, whether we want to or not. Oh. Oh? Agent Cruller? I hope I didn't lose him in the woods. Where are we? Wow. It's really all still here. The Great Needle Gulch. So much history here. I mean... This is where you assembled the team that would become the Psychonauts. This is where you first discovered Cytanium. Where Otto made his first psychoactive devices. Where Cassiopeia wrote her books. Where Helmut Colbert workshopped his psychodicy. Where Bob Zanotto and Compton Bull pioneered communication with plants and animals. And where... where... I mean... This is where it all began. No, Raz. This is where it all ended. So this is considered a new hub area? Okay. I guess it has a map. That makes sense. Yep, definitely a new hub area. Wow, 27 more challenge cards. Two more supply chests. God damn. Okay, so there's a whole nother freaking hub area that we have now. Oh, boy. Well, guys, I know there's a lot here. I can see it already, but I'm going to save all the fun of exploring a whole new area for a whole nother session. That'll be fun, right? This is a good place to stop, I think. We just got that whole little twist where Grandma is Caligula, Maligula, Bitch Bajigula, Bajiggle Jiggle. We'll have to fuck that bitch up, but um, we got to get her provoked first. She's going to wake up. It's going to happen. We're not going to be able to keep her contained. Come on, man. You know shit's going to go down eventually. But yeah, next time on Psychonauts 2, we're going to explore a new area. This should be fun. And uh, we'll see what kind of mines await us 
as we press on with the game, shall we? But thank you for watching. Hope you're enjoying so far, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.